Alright, what's up guys, back with another video, and in today's video, we are going to be showing you guys how to transfer a, how to transfer a, um, data, or videos, or pictures, or anything from your Android device to your iPhone device. So I am currently recording on my iPhone, so step one, what you want to do, is you want to go to Play Store, and you want to wait for it to load and stuff, and you want to search up you want to search up OneDrive, okay? And you need to have an account for this. If you do not have a Yahoo account, uh, any any type of account for this, this will not work unless you create one. So what you want to do is, it says update for me, but it will really say install for you guys. So you just want to go ahead and click update or install or whatever it says for you. And just wait for this to do its thing here. Wow, that's loading basically what this video is is basically it's a very simple way and it works all the time so you can store it in so once it's done what you want to hit is open you want to hit open on this and you it will show like create an account and stuff basically I'll go over the sequence for you guys right here so let me go over the sequence so right here it will say sign in with your uh, it will say with your personal work or school account so just sign in with your account you can pause this video if you need more time to do that but just sign in with your account whatever account you have and once you are in your account what uh, what you can do if this is very useful for YouTube videos as well if you're trying to do something on your iPad or tablet or whatever because I know they don't support YouTube shorts so this is what I do most of the time so as you can see here I'm just recording a quick video real quick just I'm gonna just record a couple second video so now that we have that done what you want to do is you want to go into the gallery of your phone or your tablet or iPad, whatever you have, and you want to click at the top right here, you want to click share, okay? And once you have that, it's going to show you right here all the things you can share. You want to hit OneDrive, okay? So once you hit OneDrive, you want to store it in something whatever folder so for example i'm gonna store it in pictures so i click pictures and i click this check mark right here and as you can see right here it's uploading files to onedrive so it's uploading the files to onedrive right now and it might take a couple seconds but it should be able to as you can see right there it is about done and it's completed so now what you want to do is I'll, I will come back on this um, on my tablet. Okay, guys, we are back on my tablet. So what you want to do is you want to go to your app store on your iPhone, and you want to type in, and you want to type in, oh, sorry for all these pop-ups, guys. Okay, so you want to type in OneDrive. So just type in OneDrive and hit it, and it will show up in a second. And you just want it will say install, but for me I already have it installed. So and once it's done installing, just hit open. I'm gonna put the camera down for a second, and it will greet you with the same thing. It will greet you with the same thing that you had on your account. So it will greet you with this, but it will just say personal account again. So once you're signed into there. What you want to do is you want to go on your pictures because you already have it stored in your pictures. And right here, as you can see, the video is right here. And if we play it over, watch it. It will take a second, sorry guys. And look, as you can see, the video is perfect quality and it is right there. So once that's done, you can click on this video and you want to hit download. It will download it to your gallery. So you want to hit download and wait for it to download. So once it says video saved, you can go into your gallery. So I'm going to put the camera down for a second again, guys. Sorry about that. And look, 
the video is right here. So if you want, you can go on your editing app or anything. So if personally, I use CapCut. So I would just go on CapCut. I recommend you guys use it. It's a pretty good mobile editing. And you just hit new project. And you just hit your video. And if you want to combine it with the video, you just hit the two videos and boom. The video is right there. You have all your settings you can choose to remove it to. But guys, this is a new method of how to transfer from your Android to your iPhone. And remember, OneDrive only has 5 gigabytes. But that is okay because it, the old videos, you can just delete all those. Make sure you guys like and subscribe for more helpful tips like this. And I will see you guys in the next upload.